Try this sums from page number 175. The first numerical is 5 divided by 4. Here we have to write a number and then in its denominator 16 is there. So let us check a link between these two numbers. When we are multiplying 4, with 4 we will get here 16. So above and below we have to multiply with 4. So here we have to multiply with 4 with 5. So we will get here 20 and 20 is going to be our answer here. So answer here is 20. Now again the next is 25 and in its denominator we have to guess that which number will come. So 25, so from 20, 25 we will not get. So we must have multiplied 5 along with the 5. So we got answer here 25. So here with 4 we are going to multiply 5. So 4 into 5 we will get 20. So 20 will be the answer for second place. Then the third one is minus 15 divided by we have to guess the number here. Now minus 15 we have multiplied 3 to the 5 to the original number and then we got minus 15. But minus 15 is there so we must multiply minus 3 over here. Then only we will get minus 15 because 5 is positive so we need here negative sign to get the answer in negative. So, we have to multiply minus 3 with 4 also. So, when we will multiply minus 3 with 4, 4 into minus 3, we will get minus 12 as an answer. So, our third answer is going to be minus 12. So, all this multiplication is with the original number. So, minus 3 by 7 is there and second number is numerator we have to guess and we have denominator that is 14. So, we must have multiplied here 2. Then we got here 14. So, we have to multiply 2 in numerator also. So, we will get 6 and that will be negative because 3 is negative. Now, next number is 9. In division, we have to guess the number. So, we have multiplied with 3. 3 into 3 is 9. But 9 is positive. Whereas here 3 is negative. So if we required positive answer, we must multiply minus 3. Then only we will get 9. It is something like this. That minus 3 is there. We are going to multiply minus 3. So our answer is positive and that is 9. So here also we have to multiply it with minus 3. So 7 into minus 3 we will get minus 21. Then our next number is minus 6 and in division we have to guess the number. So with original number we have multiplied 2 and we need answer in negative. So let this 2 be positive. So minus 3 into 2 we will get minus 6. So here also we are going to multiply with 2. So 7 into 2 we will get 14 as an answer. So, in first place, we will get minus 6, then we will get minus 21, then we will get 14. Second set of question answers and first question is, is 5 a positive rational number? So, 5 is there, we can write 5 divided by 1. So, it is in the form of P divided by Q. Now, what are the rational numbers? Rational numbers are always in the form of P divided by Q where Q can never be 0. So all these numbers are termed as rational numbers. So here P divided by 1. So 5 divided by 1 is in the form of P by Q. So yes, it is positive rational number because here we cannot see any negative sign. So it is positive and it is a rational number. So it is positive rational number. Now second question. List 5 more positive rational number. We have to write only positive rational number. So we can write 1 divided by 3, then 7 divided by 4, then 5 divided by 7, 3 divided by 2 and 7 divided by 9. All these numbers are positive and they are in the form of rational number. Even we can write 6. 
So 6 is in the form of rational number. It is a whole number. We can always write 1 in its denominator. So 6 is rational number. So thank you for watching and learning with us. If you have any doubt, please comment down below. I'll see you in next video. Till then, keep learning, keep sharing. And don't forget to subscribe, learn yourself.